I got a really easy project for you today. I call it a Lynx Joule Inverter. You're going to be able to do this without any special skills. You don't need any transistors or soldering irons. Um, anyway, it's real fun. I'll show you how to do it. I'm calling this the Lynx Joule Inverter. Um, we're taking 12 volts and we're running it through a transformer and lighting these 120 volt LEDs. Um, it's running at about, for all three of these, 100 milliamps from the 12 volt. So it's um, definitely a low draw. I can get it down to about 15 milliamps. All right, this is a little simple circuit I, I came up with, just messing around, trying different things, trying to make it simple. These are um, three watt LED bulbs. There's two uh, GE, and that's a Philips. Um, basically, this is uh, you know a Radio Shack transformer. There's no transistors. There's no capacitors, no resistors. It's just hook up the transformer. 12 volt. Got three bulbs running at uh, 100 milliamps. And I wanted to show you. You can use any transformer you want. That's a little audio. Um, Transformer from Radio Shack. It's like a buck fifty-nine. That's an Ecor um, jewel ringer, 3.0, kind of torn apart. This is just the transformer. This is the little audio transformer. Tiny little thing, and it's drawing uh, close to fifty milliamps for the three bulbs. I'll take one out. Take a look. There's 42 milliamps for those. Gonna screw one. There's 15 milliamps for that one. That's just off that little tiny uh, transformer. Then we'll try the uh, the e core. And it's pulling 170 milliamps to light those three. I'll show you the frequency on this. Well, my meter, my hertz meter is beeping, but it's about um, 600 hertz. So here's an E-Core as an example, um, just a comparison. Control ringer. It's running one amp. A little over an amp. As the voltage drops, it has to pull more amps. Bulbs are much brighter. Just as a way of comparison. Amps are up to one. Just to show you. E core. Two bulbs. 0.6. One bulb, a third of an amp. So again, here's the E core without the transistor. We're running 0.158. Here I have just one bulb lit off the little audio transformer. 20 milliamps. Sometimes if I move the outer tap, drop it a little bit, there's 14 milliamps. So basically, um, the ratio, we change the ratio when we go to the um, outer tap or the middle tap. That's about as low as I can get it. 14, 15 milliamps. But that's pretty neat because that bulb requires 48 milliamps at 120 volts. Here we are running it on 14 milliamps and 12 volts. So that's pretty cool. So all you need is a, a transformer. Um, you may have one, get one at Radio Shack. Um, and you need a non dimmable light bulb. I'm using the 3 watt Phillips and the 3 watt GE.
Um, those work real well. They will flash when you hook them up to straight 12 volt, um, but they won't run like this until you throw them through a transformer. So enjoy. I hope you have fun. And um, I'm sure many of you can come up with some better ways to do this and, and get the amp draw down or the brightness up. This is just the first try, so hopefully it sparks some, some interest and in some more exploring. Thanks.